right, what is up, Polyphia here. We got Scott, Tim, and Clay from Polyphia. And we're gonna tell you guys about our pre-show rituals. My ritual, I like to just get myself in the zone, take a minute, think a little bit. This shit always helps. Not this specific, specifically, I don't really know what the hell this is, but you know, alcohol in general. All right, yeah, Bud Light, that's more, that's more my world. Just have a drink, you know, loosen up the old bones, get up there, and because uh, if I don't, I'm usually just like a stick. I'm just like, oh shit. <laughs> <laughs> and then this stuff loosens me up a little bit. Uh, it helps a lot. But uh, that's pretty much my ritual, other than like warming up, which I hardly ever do nowadays, but sometimes I do like to warm up and actually get the blood flowing in the fingers. Sometimes I go like this. You know, that's what I'm talking about. Get the hair out of my face, and then I'm ready to rock and roll. I have a guitar that doesn't go on stage in a practice amp, and uh, I warm up 20 minutes before. I guess my pre-show ritual is just like drink. <laughs> oh yeah? Yeah, I get like a, I get a solid drunk going, like a lot of times, um, just because like, I have like a front meaning like job other than just like playing so like I get I like to get like really loose before we go out it kind of gets me a little more ambitious and I'll like I don't know I'll get loud and like I don't know I'm just more prone to like be willing to like let go and like have fun and shit um, I have like some stretching that I like to do like do some push-ups you know stretch hamstrings and my calves too you know just like try not to, I try not to think too much although that never works because I always think too much like I think every day on this tour I've been like <sighs> oh, I'm nervous dude oh. yeah. yeah you have <laughs> you've been very not chill on this tour and I'm just like yo dude you nervous or what and he's like yeah man fuck <laughs> oh. <laughs> I did. a point to like not go see the crowd and like to just uh -huh. I literally know what like the stage looks like in our green room and that's sometimes it's good not to get too familiar with what's out there yeah. so like when it when you go out there it's sort of like i don't know that way don't trip can, about it and like yeah dwell on it and linger on it because otherwise it's just like once i do get out there it's just like i put way too much thought on this already so i'm kind of the opposite like if i go out and mingle a little bit or like quite a bit then i don't know it's less of like a mystery as to what's going on out there and it like helps me keep my mind preoccupied and less likely to like wander into like nervousness I guess so our group ritual that we always do we usually have a drummer here yeah he's not here with us right now but we warm up whoever's the best gets on top which is always me he's got one more hand left but that's all right pinky's out always and now we go well actually change up a little bit <laughs> let's do the old one first all right, all right. We, we could have had it all. all. But now we say, we, we have, have it all. <laughs> and that's because what we do right before we walk Not on. only the biggest, but also the best, and also the greatest metal band of all time. 